Hello, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna download and install a new version of the Unreal Engine. So I will teach to you how you can get the official and secure Unreal Engine without any third part uh, unofficial website. So everything here is totally free. So Unreal Engine is free, you can download and you just need to have the account. So I'm going to show to you right now and let's go right here. We have the Epic Games. However, this is like the store and you can't get the Unreal Engine by here. So what you need to do, you can go right here and type Unreal Engine. And you can go right here in the Unreal Engine and clicking download or since we have the uh, epic games uh, we can go also at epic game store right here you can change your language so if this is like very hard to you you can change you just click in this globe and then change your language and our website will be translated. So right here we are at Epic Games and also we can go at unrealengine.com. So what we're gonna do, you don't need to sign in right here. You need to click in download. So you can save in another directory. So in my case, I will download in this PC slash downloads. So I will click in save. Uh, right here looks like was already downloaded because my connection are fast i can do two separate things i can open directly right here or i can open in the folder so right here in the folder this is my latest uh, file so all of the other images are from to post in the instagram so what we need to do is go right here and click install or you can go right here if this not appears to you you can use the command ctrl j and right here you can click then you click in run wait a little bit so right here you click in install yes I like to install the Epic Games at the default uh, folder of the C directory. So this will be installed in the system. And it's kind of more fast. So then you click in yes. And in my case, I have the NVMe. So it's a fast SSD. Uh, what we need to do right here now is wait a little bit. They will ask to update. So everything here is automatic. So they are downloading an update. And then we can sign in. Now you click in yes because we need to install the launcher prerequisites. And now we can sign in. So if you don't have an account, you can click right here, create account right here. If you create account, you need to put your dates. This is very easy to do. However, I have already have an account. So I have a Google account. I will click right here. They will open the Google. I will click in continue. I will choose one of my accounts. So my main account has a lot of assets from a real marketplace because I am an older user. So right here now is everything fine. I click in continue. I can close this window. I will maximize this window. So right here I am in my account. So this is the Epic Games Store, we can buy some games right here. This is like Steam. However, 
what we need to do is go to Unreal Engine. If I click in Library, you can see the games that you have. In my case, I have Fortnite, so I hope this appears right here because I've uninstalled the Epic Games to record this video. So what you're gonna do is go in the Unreal Engine, then you go to Library, and right here we are not seeing any engine. So that's a problem when we uninstall the Epic Games Launcher. Uh, they are not finding right here. So this is good because I can showcase to you how you can install any Unreal Engine. So after you go to Unreal Engine library, you need to click right here in Engine Versions. So you click right here in this plus. You can choose right here the version that you want. So this five is a totally um, different engine than for the 27 because this is a, the newer version uh, 5.4.3 is the new version I click install and they will open right now that's good um, for me this is okay but I don't like yeah they don't come right here so right here in the 5.4 dot three this is the newest version i will just um clicking apply see program files epic games fc program files epic games then you clicking install so clicking yes and now this um engine will start to be downloaded and then it will install automatically of course you can download different engines so in my case for my video tutorials i will gonna do an open word series about how you can create and optimize open words so what we need to do is i will install the other version of the engine so i will need to have this for the 27 I will click in install. This is in the options right here in the Unreal Engine 4. We have a different uh, checklist. So I will turn off all of this because I don't need. And for me, it's okay. Uh, you can uncheck this also, but I will let as it is. I will click in apply. This will be installed right here. I will click install. Yes. And I also will need a different version. So I will choose the version 4.8. We'll click install. Um, I don't know if this version, yeah. Install. Will be right here is okay for me install yes so this version don't have the options to change what we need or not i have three different game engines we're gonna use these two right here for the open world but this tutorial also shows how we can download the 5.4 right here in downloads we can check the progress and we can see the download, the read, the write, and the operations. These also right here are what here in the quid. So after this complete, they will start to download these other different engines. Okay, so, so after we downloaded all the Unreal Engine, uh, we also can edit the right here in the arrow you can go to options and if you need to install the android ios linux tv os you can just check right here and apply so this will be downloaded okay so you don't need to delete your engine and reinstall using this configuration so 
you can also uninstall some uh, something that is already in the disk however this is just if you are using the 5.4 and you want to create mobile games so right here you just enable android or if you are developing for ios you check right here ios and that's it okay so you don't need to delete the engine and redownload however if your disk size is becoming a lot uh, huge because this real engines versions you can simply click in one of you are not using anymore and uninstall with this x okay so that's it for today thanks so much guys i see you soon please give a like and subscribe so our new series of open world is insane because i've planned a lot of different um tutorials to teach to you so it will be very great to follow and you will learn a lot so that's it for today thanks so much bye bye